4시반이 돼가는데 저는 오늘 제사를 지낼 다른 것도 없고 성경 말씀으로 먼저 가신 어머니 아버지 조상들 그 다음에 일생에 딱한번 만났던 누나를 생각하면서 제사를 성경 말씀 관련 그리고 대신해야 되겠습니다. 뉴 데이 뉴유 366 devotion for enjoying everyday life. Love is impartial. If love is unconditional, then it must not show partiality. Partiality. Your best life begins each morning. Devotion to start every day of the year. God sees the big picture. Isaiah chapter 55. For my thought are not your thought, neither are your ways my ways, declare the Lord. As the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your, your ways, and my thought than your thought. Isaiah chapter 55 verse 8 through 9. Next level thinking. 10 powerful thought for a successful and abundant life. Get the contaminants out. I don't know about you, but I have found bitterness is always knocking at the door. People do, do you wrong. You didn't get the promotion. You came down with an illness. You can't stop difficult things from happening to you, but you can choose how you respond to them. The abundance mindset success started here. That's how negative memories are stored in our brain. The bad takes up more space than the good. Tune in to good memories. Time minded face. Sensing success in dark times. Standing up for your conviction. You are made for more. How to become all you were created to be. Think better, live better. A victorious life begins in your mind. Keep your crown. When God breathed his life into you, he put a crown on your head. Your best life, life now. Seven steps to living and your full potential. Enlarge your vision. Today is that day and you are that man. Bible power for successful living. Find the answers to life's problems. Be confident in God's promises. Accept each day as God's gift. Know the importance of honesty. Use the power of faith and hope. Trust God. The Bible's teachings apply in all of life's circumstances. The power of your subconscious mind. These two people went back together and my suggestion and experimented with prayer therapy. The voice begins in the mind. Blessed in the darkness, how all things are working for your good. This problem is never going to work out, but your faith will kick in. Your 
your best life now. Develop a healthy self for the image. The late the singer Case said it well. It's so hard to see when my eyes are on me. You can become the person you want to be. The boy answered, I'm sorry, sir. I have not started that yet. He, he charged up with a positive mental attitude. Insurgism that never fade. Is it possible? Yes. If you always maintain a positive mental attitude. The fragile female finding peace in the midst of daily life. Getting a handle on life is an inside job. Christians are not immune to the pressures and anxieties of daily life. What we have within us all we need to meet and manage life's daily assault. You can, you will, eight undeniable qualities of uh, the winner. That's a definite plan. When you take responsibility for your growth, God will honor your efforts. You spend the time just like you spend money. Be anxious for nothing. The art of casting your cares and resting in God. Your best life now allow God's word to refresh you and to reshape your thinking, speaking, and daily activities. God's creative power. I had to put out a fleece. Judgment. Judgment. Judging. Chapter 6. People the Lord are about to be speeding still. Well, all the fleece turned out just the way I asked. The purpose driven life. What on earth am I here for? Thinking about my purpose. Point to ponder. God deserve my best. First to remember. Do your best to present yourself to God as one approved. A working man who does not need to be ashamed and who correctly handle the word of truth, Second Timothy. Discover the power of your thought and words. You must learn to be a giver and not a taker. He became a, a, a giver. 365 Bible prayers for children, a prayer a day. I hope to keep my eyes open so I can receive your word. Say please say thank you, the respect we owe one another. But mom's comments about their relationship have been nagging at dad and so he decided it's time for some serious attention to at least one aspect of their relationship and just as They've reached the point where pajamas have been shed and the cupboards are being thrown back. The telephone rings yet again, and this time they have the good sense to let the answering machine deal with it. But the voice on the other end is grandma, sounding agitated, and so what could they do but answer the yet? Communication and the conflict resolution of biblical perspective. Communication and the conflict resolution of biblical perspective. Handling communication and the conflict resolution are two major hurdles in a marriage. Praying with the confidence. When you feel as if someone has let you down, Rebuilding trust and re-establishing what you once had in your relationship takes time, even when that someone is the God. 
a competent woman devotional, 365 daily inspiration. Jeremiah chapter 18, in his hands, and the vessel that he was making from clay was spoiled in the hand of the potter, so he made it over, reworking it into another vessel, as it seemed good to the potter to make it. Released from bondage, the true stories of freedom from guilt and hurtful memories. Understand the true nature of the spiritual battle all Christians face. Power to reinvent yourself. How to break the destructive patterns in your life. Although I was distraught over how I was going to pay the bill, I continued to make it. How to handle your emotion, anger, depression, fear, grief, rejection, self-worth. What is the key to God's acceptance? Have you ever tried to open a door with a key, but the wrong with the key? Choosing gratitude, your journey to the joy. I remember his mom and dad telling me how earnestly he kept this up after they got home, eventually writing more than a hundred notes to those who had prayed for his recovery and even more for his spiritual restoration. Our daily the bread. If you have never known the forgiveness of God, it can be yours right now. All that remains is for you to personally choose to trust in the one who has done so much for you. He died on the cross to pay the penalty for our sins. <sighs> Hope for today and the Bible. The endless river of righteousness, Amos chapter 5. Instead, I want to see a majority, mighty, mighty flood of justice, and an endless river of righteous living. God loves you, God loves you so much. He doesn't want anything to stand in the way of your relationship with Him. Living a life for God isn't about going through the motions or checking up a list of do's and don'ts. It's about having a heart that desires to live His way. When we have a heart that is surrendered to Him, then His righteousness will flow like river through us and affect every area of our lives. You love what God loves, and you'll quickly turn away from anything that displeases Him. Devoting your church at the first sign of disappointment or disillusionment is a mark of immaturity. God had things he wants to teach you and others too. Besides, there is no perfect church to escape to. Every church has its own set of weakness and problems. You'll soon be disappointed again. <clears throat> One year book of a family devotion, 365 stories that apply the Bible of life, Bible to life today. The father said those date, he replied, and they are not for you to know. To memorize the good news about the kingdom will be preached throughout the whole world so that all nations will hear it. Matthew chapter 24 Overcome Adversity Insight into the Life of Joseph Abused and sold into slavery by his brothers, Joseph could have lived a life filled with bitterness and hate. Instead, he stood on his face in God to save him and eventually returned home 
in triumph to pardon those who wronged him. Disappointment can destroy a man who are placed in God's other hands, turn him into more than he ever imagined, overcoming adversity. All things are working for your good. Every time I've seen major growth in my life, every time I've stepped up to a new level, it happened because I was pushing. Don't drop the, on the mic. The best communicators command the attention of their audience without any show of a voice. They don't bubbly, bully, berate, or brobeat. Brobeat. Though the collected individuals assembled before them for whatever reason or occasion. Brobeat. God's blueprint, life-changing sermon outlines. He knows what is better for us, and so we should have to pray in accordance to His will and glory and depend on Him for our needs. Start your new life today, an exciting new beginning with God. Are you ready to start your new life today? Are you tired of living the way you are living? <sighs> 기즈성경으로 시편 23편을 적어봐요. 3 chapter 23, a psalm of David. The Lord is my shepherd. He gives me everything I need. He let me lie down in field of green grass. He lead me beside the quiet waters. He gives me new strength. He guide me in the right path for the honor of his name. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I will not be afraid. You are with me. You pre you are shepherds, Lord, and the staff comfort me. You prepare a feast for me right in front of my enemies. You pour oil on my head, my cup runs over. I'm sure that your goodness and love will follow me all the days of my life, and I'll live in the house of the Lord forever. Amen. Be all you can be a challenge to stretch your God-given potential. I want to close by giving you some problem-solving principles. We handle our problems based on what we see and what we seek. If we see our problems correctly, and if we have a goal that is bigger than our problems, there's no problem that we can't solve. The happiest people on earth are not people without problems. The happiest people on earth are people who have learned to appreciate, to appreciate the possibilities for growth that problems bring. Masterpiece in the making, life lesson for spiritual growth. At one point, we began seeing the conversion of former prisoners and drug addicts. The upside of adversity rising from the pit to greatness. Even worse, the church had become proud of its tolerance of a sin that even the pagans found shameful. Battlefield of the mind, winning the battle in your mind. Have a positive outlook and other attitudes. Maintain a positive thought and expectation. Engage in positive conversation. Leadership promise for every day. Have you ever wondered 
what gave Samuel such credibility with the others. When he spoke, people listened. First Samuel chapter 3. So Samuel grew, and the Lord was with him, and let none of his words fall to the ground. And all of Israel from Dan to Beersheba knew that Samuel had been established as a prophet of the Lord. The purpose-driven life. Nothing on us is more valuable to God than His church. Peaceful on purpose, the power to remain calm, strong, and confident in every season. There are several thousand people in communication, hundreds in, in this room alone. How can I ever find, found him, find him? Out of the thousands of students, it just so happened they were sitting next to each other. Victories are not just for you. Allow God's word to refresh you and to reshape your thinking, speaking, and daily activities. 21 Ways to Finding Peace and Happiness Overcoming Anxiety, Fear, and Discontentment Every Day If he had been dependent on me to make him happy, he would have never enjoyed life because I gave him no reason to rejoice, rejoice. Masterpiece in the, the making. I credit Dr. Gregory for this lasting passion. Power Salt, 12 strategies to win the battle of the mind. God is a God of abundance, and He wants us to live abundant lives. Your best life now, let go of the past. God sees your acts of kindness and mercy as well. When you are kind to people, when you go around doing good to people, God arranges for others to leave behind handfuls of good things for you. My first favorite Bible verses. We can't accurately imagine our child's future. We can't predict what problems our child will be forced to solve or situation he will meet. But when God's rules are imprinted on his heart, he will cope more effectively with the challenges of life. children's book from the Bible. Suddenly the fingers of a human hand appeared and wrote on the wall. That made the king afraid, prophets and prediction. God used dreams and visions to speak to his people. God used dreams to speak to people when they were on the asleep, asleep. What are, your, what are your plans? How do you see your life unfolding, unfolding? The best remedy for a short temper is a long walk. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on us as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as you forgive those who trespass against us. Choose to be the happy. Now think about the odds of such an occurrence. That certainly was not an accident or a coincidence. Trusting God day by day, 365 daily devotion. Trust in Him. Think about time, then your back was against the wall, and God has delivered you. Celebrate that victory all over again, 
and the trust of that God will deliver you the next time. <clears throat> your best life begins each morning. Be careful with your words. Fathers, do not exasperate, exasperate your children. Instead, bring them up in the training and the instruction of the Lord. Ephesians chapter 6. Do you see the power of your voice? Be extremely careful about when you are when you are allowed to come out of your mouth. The next time you are tempted to talk down, to talk down to somebody, to belittle your child or degrade him, remember you can't ever get those words back. Once you speak them, they take on a life of their own. Make sure it's a good life. When bad things happen to the good people, the second element is the notion that we are the cause of what happens, especially the bad things that happen. <sighs> Okay, so, yes, I am.